Hi everyone, it's Mark Christopher. Welcome to KCTS 9 Cooks Just Desserts. And we got one for you. Our friend Leslie Mackey from Macrina Bakery is here with yep. a summer berry pudding. Yes. Big chunk of bread sitting in front of us here, Leslie. Exactly. <laughs> it's uh, layered with um, brioche or any kind of white bread. Mm -hmm. And then it is set with gelatin. So it's packed with delicious berries that of course here in the Pacific Northwest we've got a plentiful amount right um, and then those berries are kind of juicy and so it's thickened with the gelatin I can't wait it's really tasty <laughs> we're just removing the removing all the darker areas mm -hmm. I prefer to use brioche in this recipe because it is so delicious uh -huh. um, you know it's a t it's a typical French uh, breakfast bread uh, made with eggs sugar and a little bit or a lot of bit of butter okay awesome so this is th so this is our brioche loaf cut in little uh, quarter inch slices mm. what we're gonna do is we're gonna layer it into the bunt mold okay would you do I'm thinking pudding individual servings could we do that you too? can also do the individual servings in fact at the bakery we do an individual serving okay you know this this is a little bit of a labor of love but we're we're layering it in like so you want to just you just want to uh, kind of butt it up next to each other. Okay. If you can see, we're kind of uh, we're keeping the curve to one side, mm -hmm. and that way it doesn't create a super big thickness of uh, of, of bread in one area. Okay. Well, I like to use um, our day old bread, so it uh, you can certainly use a fresh loaf, mm -hmm. but if you use a day old bread uh, loaf, it's a little easier to cut and a little bit more manageable. Okay. There we go. That'll work just nice. And we're working with berries, so summer berries. Um, the recipe calls for, uh, we have boysenberries, fresh raspberries, and then blueberries. Mm -hmm. And uh, you could use strawberries, blackberries. You know, it's, it's, it's all up to you. Okay. We're going to cook about two-thirds of the berries. All right. I'm going to put them in here. We're going to sweeten them with sugar. Okay. Okay. But it's got most of them. This will take a little while to cook, so we're just gonna. And about a medium heat there, Leslie. About a medium heat, yeah. Nothing better than fresh berries. I know <laughs> these are really stunning. Really colorful. Yeah. We just sprinkle the gelatin over the water. It's cold is, water. Is there anything, Leslie, I can do wrong now that I need to be careful of? No. Okay. Not a darn thing. Uh, you know me. I always yeah. watch for that. <laughs> we're just gonna sprinkle it over the top, and it will do its magic. How you introduce gelatin to your mixture, you wouldn't want to put that right into your berries. So you want to dissolve the gelatin in the cold water, mm -hmm. and then we're going to add a little bit of the hot um, juice into the gelatin that will, that will dissolve it, okay. and then we'll add all of that to the berries. Okay, so this is getting pretty juicy. I'm going to add these other berries in, and the reason why I'm adding the berries in at half, half cooking process mm -hmm. Because I want a little bit more texture. Yeah. So I was gonna say because that looks like almost a jam or a jelly you're ex cooking there. Exactly. Okay. This is gonna cook probably for about another two or three minutes. Mm -hmm. We're gonna add just a little bit of zest to this. Can you smell that lemon? Mm hmm And why the lemon, Leslie? You know, because lemon is a nice uh, a nice counterbalance with the other with the berry. So we're just gonna look here. See we we're saucy. We got some good sauce going on here. Okay. Can you see how that's dissolved? Mm -hmm. Okay. That was very fast. Uh, you know, that's what. That's how it works. This is something that has to set up for at least twenty-four hours. Wow. Yeah. All right. So we're gonna add this in here. Ooh, I didn't do that. Okay, let's mix this up. Let's, we're going to ladle this in. All the way around. And again, we want it juicy like this because we want to saturate all that bread. Okay. I'm going to save a little bit of this for the top because I we have to saturate the top too. Okay. I'm going to go like so. Okay. There we go. Very nice. Now, 
so what we're going to do is we're going to kind of go around here. Okay, now I'm going to do that. You got it? Yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I'm going to put this right on the top. We're going to put some pressure on this. We're going to use those cans. Okay, so this is how we're just weighting it down. We are weighting it down. Leslie, what would happen if you didn't do all this weighting to the pudding? Um, it just it compresses it so that when you invert it, it's a solid pudding. That's what you want. As opposed That's our goal. to okay. yeah, as opposed to kind of airy in there. All right. Okay. I've never seen anything like this before. I life. know. <laughs> Okie doke. It's another great recipe and a dessert at that. Yeah. Okay, so this has been sitting in the refrigerator for about 24 hours. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to remove these cans so we, just don't, we don't need those. And you can feel how firm it is. It's pretty firm. Okay. Yeah. I get you. So it's definitely set up. That would be your key. All right, I'm going to unfold this. And I am going to invert this onto my pan. And you can invert it onto a dinner plate, whatever you'd like. Mm -hmm. Oh. And oh, wow, look at that. There Ooh. we go. Wow. Ready for it to hit the stage, everybody. Yep. And here it comes. There we go. See, this makes a beautiful presentation. And what I'm going to do is put some flowers on it, which I like to do. Put a few flowers on there like so. Okay, and then another thing is you could put berries in the center, which mm. would be a really pretty presentation. But I always serve it with whipped cream, so yeah. you could also put whipped cream in the center. Yeah. Whatever Look you wish. That. Summer but, berry pudding. Look at that. Mm, there you go. I like your definition, a little whipped cream. Yes. <laughs> Look at it. Outstanding. Look at Do that. Do you want to try a little taste? Okay. Is this the big time? That This Let is. Let me give you that, too. Okay. Thank you. Let's share it as well. I always water. like to share in the process. Let's go for it. Kay. Summer berry pudding. Leslie Mackey. Macrina Oops. Bakery. It's mm. a favorite. And it is. Oh, boy. Okay. Mm, delicious.